I am in my new house in Atlanta and I have no idea where I left you off. I think I wanted to film a unpacking vlog. That didn't happen mainly because we got here and had to just unpack and it was Sunday and Monday we started working again. It was really hectic. We have been in our new house in Atlanta for two weeks. I am actually leaving for South Africa tomorrow again. For anyone who is new, my name is Caitlin. I am from South Africa. I am living in the US. I've been here for almost seven years. I was in San Francisco from 2018 to 2020. And then I moved to Denver, Colorado from 2020 to two weeks ago. And now I am in Atlanta, Georgia. We have moved from an apartment to a four bedroom house, which is incredible. I am just going to do a quick get ready with me I decided to buy a whole bunch of new Sephora goodies before I head out to South Africa for three weeks and I've definitely been influenced. I have bought some Armani Beauty for the first time, Merit Beauty as well and I thought I would just quickly do my makeup before I have to hop on a call. Let me just clip my hair back. I am rushing around like a mad person trying to pack for three weeks we are going to be in Cape Town where I am from it is much colder than Atlanta less humid and it is pouring with rain pretty much most days so let me start with my primer I actually bought this a while ago I re-bought the Dior primer their backstage face and body primer one thing i don't love about this bottle is it would rub off so hopefully this new one won't but i do love the dual primer i'm just going to put a primer on my eyelid and i've been loving the rare beauty eye primer which i bought a while ago and i bought some other rare beauty goodies i've Got a new mirror behind me it's beautiful hopefully you cannot get the lawn mower going at something new we have a beautiful lawn but someone is using i think a leaf blower some new things from sephora that i got i was deeply influenced and i got the armani eye tint in 22m so i'm going to try that now and then I've been wanting to try their Illumina Silk foundation. This is in 3.75. So I hope I color matched correctly. Let me double check. Yes, it's 3.75. Also going to use the Merit Blush Beverly Hills Blush Balm. They have just launched new packaging, which is gorgeous. That I'm going to try. Then I also got their mascara, which I thought I would try. And let's just have a quick look at that. So I'm going to try the mascara and then to continue on with Merit Beauty, I am going to try their lip gloss, which is their Shaded Stick Tinted Lip Oil in Marrakesh. Let's start with, I don't know, let me start with the foundation. I'm going to go in with the Armani Lumina Silk. I really hope I colored match correctly because I really don't feel like going to return this. Let's see. And Oh dear. I don't think I color match correctly. I think it's too light. That's always the problem with buying a color online. I think I might have to go into Sephora to get color matched. But I want to just wear it for a day. So I can go back. I can go tomorrow and exchange it before I fly out. Because we fly out really late. 9 p.m. I don't know. Is this my color? I have broken out so much since moving to Atlanta. But we will fix that. There's meant to be another light in this bathroom and it's super cool shades almost. Maybe I'm the right color. Who knows? I'm not too sure. I think I'm going to double double check. I did get the mini version. The travel version just to kind of see if it would match maybe i just keep it and use it as a concealer because sometimes i like to go lighter with my concealers let's just do this i am going to put on my dior show one end concealer i don't know why it's it's gone this way it's 
kind of split a little bit, so that's very strange. I don't know if you can see that. I'm trying to make everything focus. So yeah, you can see this concealer I got matched. I bought this when I was in Dubai. The Tarte brush, which is amazing. I've got red undertones in my skin. Maybe this works. I hate returning products. That's why I'm just trying to figure out how to make this work. For me, I'm just going to go under the chin. We're still just going to see how this works. I'm then going to try the Armani tint. In 22M, I'm going to use the smudge brush. I smudge. This is from Bobbi Brown. Bought a while ago. How much did I put on? I want to put too much on. Let's see. I really want to try and get a more natural look during the day. This looks great. It's a really pretty color. What do we think? Let's put some more on here. And then this can just be easy for everyday wear. Okay, let's smudge this in. What I was saying is, it's always great to have a easy makeup solution. I think I went a little bit, uh, a little bit too much over here. Let's see, I'm gonna put some mascara on, make my eyes pop a little bit. But first impressions, I really like the color. I think it makes my eyes pop. I bought a new lash primer, so I thought I would try the Sephora one. This is the first time I'm using this primer from Sephora. This just helps to make my eyes more voluminous because I don't use fake eyelashes. I am going to try out the new Merit Mascara for the first time. I've never used Merit Mascara. Definitely influenced. Oh, that's pretty. What do we think? Oh, I like that. That's very pretty. If you can hear a bell, it's Coco. She's in my closet. Coco is my cat, for anyone that's new. Put some over here. Oh, on my nose. New eyelashes, really pretty. And I'm now going to do my eyebrows. My Benefit Pal, Pal Maid. Let's just do this quickly. I do need to turn my eyebrows. And people have laminated. Never tried that. I don't know if you should. This is bent a bit. Ah, this is... Does that look too dark? I feel like sometimes I do my eyes too dark, but I need to tint them again. Before I leave tomorrow, there's so many things I still need to do. Oh, my word, traveling is stressful. And I've traveled, I've done two already big international trips this year. I don't know how travel influences do it. I'm not even a travel influencer. But I traveled to South Africa in March. And then I went to Dubai in June. Just picking up my new brow gel. I bought this a while ago. It is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Bell Brow Gel. I think it's meant to be a harder one. Just keep these brows in place. I think I went a little bit dark, but... Anyway, and then I'm going to use the Merit Lash. It is the Flush Balm. Do I put, oh, that's nice. So subtle. Ooh, okay, let's blend that out. Blend that a little bit. Oh, I really, really like that. That's so pretty and so subtle. Ooh, pop marble. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. I'm not going to do a bronzer. I do have the, the Rare Beauty stick. I'm not going to do that. I always have used the By Terry Liquid Eyeliner. It is their pencil, but they are out of stock. So I thought I would try the Rare Beauty Liquid Eyeliner. And let's see. Okay, it comes in this like packaging. Wow. Okay. This is such cool packaging. Can see this is intense wow okay this is really cool i will be back i need to get used to this it is a very soft little brush but i think it looks good i might try and make it a little bit thicker to end off i'm going to put on the merit lip gloss which is their shade stick tinted lip oil in marrakesh and I picked more kind of like a peachy coral color. 
And oh, this is nice. I'm definitely back into my lip glosses. Here I have the finished look. Let's spray my Urban Decay setting powder. Okay, and that is all of my new beauty products. Hopefully, I can see if the Armani Luminous Silk foundation is my color. But if you liked watching this, please do subscribe, give it a like, and let me know if you want to see more of these videos. Obviously, I bought all the products myself, and I'm going to be testing them out in South Africa. And I will let you know how it goes. But have a beautiful week ahead, and I'll chat to you all soon.